Hey, it's Jamin, and in today's Team Gantt tip, we'll check out a couple of ways to get a high-level view of all of your projects and keep them organized. Today, we're looking at the Project Health Report and Portfolio View. With the Project Health Report, you get a high-level overview of how every project on your account is tracking. You can generally see if a project is behind or on schedule and drill down into the tasks that are contributing to the status of the project. Project health reports are available on all plans to users at the account holder permission level. With Portfolio, you get a dashboard view of all of your ongoing projects. Organize project and custom boards into folders and view the project health data associated with projects in the folder. Portfolio reports are only available on advanced plans. To open your project health report, click on the Reports button in the side menu. Then select Project Health. Here, you'll find a list of all of your projects with some high-level data on each. Let's go through what we have here. To the right of each project name, the overall completion percentage for that project is listed. The next section shows the health status for the project's tasks. OK tasks are green. These tasks are either ahead of or on schedule. Yellow tasks are running behind, but the deadline for completion hasn't passed. For red tasks, the deadline has passed and they're overdue. Each health status column displays the number of project tasks in that status category. Next, the project timeline shows a quick visual of the project's overall duration and start and end dates, along with a marker for where you stand today as far as work done and time remaining. Click any colored section to see the tasks that fall into that health status category. You can also filter the report by project, people, or labels. The Project Health Report is a great tool to help you quickly identify problem areas and address risk as work progresses. You can also share it on screen in meetings to keep your team or other stakeholders informed. Portfolio View takes all of the health report information to the next level. To access Portfolio View, click on Portfolio in the sidebar menu. You'll see all of the information from the Project Health Report here, but it's broken down a little differently. Portfolio View features all of your active projects and custom boards. By default, it organizes them into these three categories. Favorites, they contain any starred project, custom boards, and projects. But you can organize them into custom folders too. To create a folder, click the big blue plus icon and select New Folder. By the way, you can also create a new project or a new custom board from here. Next, choose the account to associate the new folder with, name it, and you're done. You can drag any projects or custom boards you want into your folder and collapse any folders that you don't want to see. If you want to add a project or custom board to your favorites, just click on the star to the right. You can filter to show or hide empty folders or projects that you're not on. And you can also choose which company accounts you want to view in Portfolio View. You can also choose to view active, on hold, or completed projects. One last thing about Portfolio. You may want to open all of the projects in a folder to see how the timelines interplay. To do that, just click on this icon and it will open them all up. Project Health and Portfolio Reports are two great ways to get quick, high-level info on how multiple projects are tracking. To learn more about how Team Gantt can help you manage multiple projects with these reports, go to teamgantt.com support.